Hello everybody, Robert Iducci here, and we are going to, um, we're going to do a little stream creation today. Uh, so we've got a new show upcoming, can't really tell the name of it yet, we haven't announced it, but uh, you'll see some, some kind of behind the scenes. I was going to try to um, make some scenes, play around, kind of see what we, uh, what we come up with. So this is just going to be a um, sort of like uh, just behind the scenes kind of thing. So we'll see. Let's see. Um, so I've got a few images that I want to kind of use as backgrounds. So I'm just going to use this scene as sort of the base scene and then mess around. So we don't really need the logos down here. So I'm going to move that. I think let me create another scene just so you can see the entire scene. So I'm going to might disappear for a second here. I'm just going to call this the opening scene. Let me go back to uh, this scene. I'm just going to duplicate this. That'll. There we go. All right. And then I want to do a. I want to get just a window capture of uh, OBS. Not that window. Um, hmm, OBS is in an option. So let's see. Let's do uh, display capture. I think it's three. No, maybe two. Hmm, doesn't look like it. One, uh, it's not showing anything. Well, I guess we're not do <laughs> doing this how, how I thought it was going to be. Um, I'm still, as you can tell, <laughs> I'm still learning um, OBS in a lot of ways. Uh, these are just a bunch of, I'm not sure why I can't grab the my OBS window. Hey, track off. Um, let's see, I tried display capture. Um, I tried window capture, so I'm not sure why it's on actually cap. I'm sorry. You'll just have to see what, what the display kind of looks like instead of my whole uh, OBS setup. So uh, I want to put like a background on here. So let's add a background. Uh, I don't need all of these, uh, all the logos. The Ulysses logo, I'll keep, down, I'll keep there for now. The logo slides, I don't need. I won't need mine, but I'll need somebody else's name. And so I'm just going to put this stuff. I actually don't need this. Uh, the chat box we don't need. My image we're gonna shrink down here um, because we will have it'll have a host actually and two people. So actually, let me. I guess we will need the. Uh, we'll need the box. Where did that go? It's over here somewhere. <clears throat> Chat box, there we go. So we'll take this, and I'm gonna, I'll recreate this. This is just sort of like a mock-up right now. Just kind of see what we need to do. And so there would be the host, well, the host information here, and then we'll need the, uh, the guest. Um, so I'm gonna duplicate this. That box. So we're copying it and paste duplicate. So there's another one. Uh, let's look at our backgrounds here. Um, so I wanted to do a sort of um, 
a radio kind of station image. So let's see. I can show you the ones I have here. Uh, let me get to here and where are we at? All right, so here are a few. I think I'm gonna have to just try them one by one, so just to kind of see what they look like. So here comes. The images, I kind of think I like. I kind of like this one, although I'm not sure about sizing. We'll see. So there's one, I guess I could just add all these. So as you can see, it's got a sort of radio style vibe to it. I kind of like this, like the old style. Might be a little bit too busy. I think all of these, because all of these are sort of radio station styles. Uh, add another image. This will all be in the same place. So there's this one. I'm just gonna add a bunch. And then I can figure out which I like best. Uh, I kind of like this one, but I think it's too big. Whoa. Um, I think it's too narrow. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, maybe not too bad. We can mess with. We can work with it. All right. Um, so this is just like the background that we're gonna use as sort of the base. Did I do this one already? And what we're trying to do is, you know, obviously give it a, uh, you know, an older radio style. We'll see which ones look the best. Yeah, I'm not really showing, I tried to show, I tried to show the, uh, the whole stream setup, like my OBS, but I'm, it's not actually letting me sh show that. Uh, I don't know if I can add open OBS again. Let's see if I can open a, it says you're already running it. Let's see what happens when I launch it. I don't know what it's gonna do right now when I launch a second version of it. Um, Uh, oh, it does show me. Okay, cool. So, although I don't know what you're, what you guys are seeing right now. Let's see if I can uh, get back over here to OBS and see if it does it. Oh, there we go. Cool. That works. Boom. So I think, yeah, I know. So I don't know. What are you seeing right now? It's, it's telling me that it's showing OBS, but I don't think it really is. Oh, maybe it's because it's way in the back. Let's bring it up to the front. Oh, it is. Cool. So. There you go. There you go. All right, so now this is, this is what my OBS looks like. So I think, I think, and then if I move this around, yeah, cool. So this works. So, um, so you can see this is my uh, this is my setup over here on the left hand side. I've got the stream chat. Um, on the right hand side, I've got just basically stream information. So I put like Ulysses grab bag stream creation, and this is all tied in through uh, through Twitch. So the stream chat and the stream information they they are I think they're called Twitch plugins or something like that. Um, I forget what they're called. Yeah, but. So I put those over there, um, and then down here we have our the scenes on the left hand side, and these are all I just copied all of this from the Ulysses World stream, um, just because it's a good base, um, and then this is all my individual sources within my stream. These are the audio mixers, uh, scene transitions, and scene controls. So um, I'm trying. What I'm trying to do uh, is kind of. I'm trying to create a new, we're going to create a new show. 
and I need a sort of 1930s or older sort of radio style. So I'm kind of trying to figure out a good background. So this is this is a background. It's pretty simple. I kind of like this one. Um, and I might, you know, even though I'm using this image, uh, I might sort of, you know, either do a sepia tone or just do a black and white or kind of slightly blur it. I'm not sure what we're going to do uh, because all of these are pretty pretty busy. So this one I like. Uh, so scene seven, I like that a lot. Uh, so this is the next one. It's a, it's much closer, so to make it a full screen, and obviously this is a, we would have to buy this image since it's a, a stock photo from Alarmy, Alarmy. Um, some of the other ones, the other images that I pulled are like Creative Commons or whatever. But I also like this. Uh, I like that one a lot too. Um, because even though it's pretty busy, it's also very like structured, so um, I don't think that would be that bad. I kind of like that one. This one is really big, I think. Yeah. This is a great image in and of itself, but it might be a bit busy for us. Yeah. Oops. I'm just kind of trying to size this to sort of see what it would look like. And as you can see, we'd have to make it bigger just to fit the whole screen. And it looks pretty busy. It's it's nice and focused, which is actually, you know, right here it's got sharp focus. Over here it's a little duller. Um, so I don't know. This one's a uh, iffy. This one doesn't really have great, it's not really a super great image. I like the shadows. I like the fact that it looks like you're looking right at it. And the fact that it is blurry probably helps with our situation. So I'm going to give that one a pass as well. All right, let's see this one. So there's this. And I'm not really a fan of this one. There's it's only half of it. Yeah, I don't like this one at all. Image three is gone. Let's remove that. All right. This one I like, but it's it's so busy. This one's super busy. There's lights everywhere. But I don't know. It is pretty cool. What do you think, Trekoff? I kind of like it, but let's see. Which one is this? This one, I think. One of the things about OBS is that uh, you get a lot of, um, it's sometimes really hard to tell which which image you're working with. There we go, this one, okay. Um, and so I like it, but I don't know, I'm not, it's, it's a little too busy, I think. Even if we have, like even if we put the, the chat box thing like on the top, and obviously the chat box would not look like this also, this is just an idea. Um, so it would be that, and then, like, let me throw my webcam on there. Or not. I don't know why that's not showing up. Hmm. Oh, probably because my webcam's on the other one. So, there would be a webcam. Um... I like the depth that it has while there are lights that are smaller, which makes it more roomy and comfortable. Yeah, so there, so in most cases in this instance, there's going to be two people. There would be, you know, a host and somebody else. Um, but then we also want another option to have multiple people as like a stream game. Um, so I don't know, I think this is that one. And right, that's the original. So uh, let's go ahead and put the. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna group these all together right now, so that I can move them all. Now they're grouped. So these are backgrounds, and then I'm gonna take the backgrounds. And I'm gonna actually move them underneath most of this. Uh, let's see, maybe there. So now I should be able to, if I add one of these, there we go. All right, so there's that one. Oh, my name's not there either. I should just go up there. 
So all this is just about layering, basically. Um, try that again with this one. Again, I, you know, images, this is just, just testing, kind of see what it looks like. Um, yeah, so I don't, you know, with, with, with these boxes, which is where the images are going to be, um, you know, we don't want it to cover up too much, but also, like, we don't want it to leave, like, down here, it looks like it's just chairs, like, that doesn't look great. So I think, I think this one's a no-go. I'm going to remove that one. All right, let's try the next one. So that's pretty good, and I can highlight these. So like, I'm going to take my name here, uh, and you can do properties. We're going to go down to outline. We're going to give it an outline to. We want it to be black, um, and then maybe let's make it three or four. Let's see what four looks like. Four looks all right. I mean, it could be more, but it just see the difference between this. And this, uh, I think it helps make the text pop a little bit. So we need to go back and do this with this part too. What did I say? Four and black. Unfortunately, you can't see all these pop-ups that are coming up, but they're there. I guess I could do, let me see if I could do... Um, whole screen capture. I think I tried that though. Um, uh, display capture. I tried it before, but it might, you know, none of, none of these are, I don't know why it's not working. Whatever. Um, let me just go back to what I was doing for. All right. So I've got these. This looks all right. Um, again, pretty busy. And there's not a lot going on here, which is fine. I mean, we could put a logo there. Uh, let's see, where's our logo? Ulysses logo. Let's put it on top of this. There we go. See, like, that could be over there. It actually looks all right. Um, and again, you can put stuff behind it to make it stand out even more. So I don't know. I kind of like that one. This logo we don't actually want in there. We want outside of it. All right, let's see the next one. It's a little, I think we're a little too up close. We're losing some of the details of what this is. Um, so I'm not a fan of that one. Let's look at this one. Again, I like the, I like the, um, the board. Wish there was like a microphone that would make this nice. Um, I don't know. So it looks like I've got, I've got four of them right now. Again, like in this, there's also no microphone here. I guess there's like a little, it's like a radio thing over here. So that one's not too bad. So I've got that one. This one, so that's number four. This is number five. This one has the microphone, but it's not right in the middle. Maybe we expanded this out a little bit. Let's see. And like the microphone is off. I don't know. I don't know. I think I just think this one's a little too close. And I think this there's a radio right here that's a little too modern for what we're looking for. So I think. I think that's this one, number five. Yeah, I think this one's a no-go. I mean, I like the picture, but I don't think it really works good for what we're trying to do here. All right. Um, so now we're just down to these three. So we've got this one. You know, also, I mean, it's got a mic right here, kind of. We could pull that more into focus. You know, not a huge fan of it, but I don't know. Uh, then we've got this one. Again, I like the board, but no mic. 
in this one. It's pretty busy and you know stuff in here won't be seen. It's like this this sign won't be seen. I mean I kind of feel like I kinda of like this one the best so far. You could also Yeah, I kinda of like it with that in there. Something like this. And I could like, I don't know, put something up here. Maybe I put the logo up here to cover that. I could blur that out a little bit. Yeah, I kind of like that. What do you think, Trekoff? I kind of like that the best. Um, you can mess around a little bit, yeah. I think it looks good. Um, obviously, there'll be a, a square in here. Let's see if I could just, I don't know if I can even just add. Might have someone's image. It's a uh, profile image. I can spell. Or just, I'll call it host image. There you go. I think I've got a couple in here. I know I have one of Bill. Let's see if I can find it. Um, not that I actually have to use Bill or an actual person. Although I thought I had one in here. <clears throat> Maybe not. Let's see. Mm, we're just going to use a picture of, yeah, here's one of Bill. So even though this is, you know, obviously not what we're going to actually use, I'm just trying to get an idea. All right, and like this would have to be underneath. Oh, I got to think of a Tim image here too. Where did that go? Tim's image. Oh, maybe not. And then we're going to add another one in here just to put another person in here. If I can find one. I'm just going to use this one to Ross. And I'll just make it big. <laughs> wow, Ross looks so different. He's got a, he's got a huge beard now. <laughs> All right, so there's kind of where I want that to sit. I'm going to shrink this down. Oops, if I can catch it. There we go. And again, I'm holding Alt. So if you if you ever play with this a little bit, if you hold Alt, you can resize the image, which is key for quickly sizing when you're before your streams or whatever. And this one, I think we need to make sure that the chat box is on top. And where's the other one? There we go. So when you put the chat box on the top, it you know bounds things to the right size. And even though Bill's head is a little, you know, I would I would shrink that down. So and even Ross's too. But this is sort of you know what we're going for more or less. Um, I still feel it's a little bit busy, so I would probably, I might like diffuse it a little bit. Um, maybe take out some of the color a little bit um, just to make it a little, you know, make it not stand out so much. And, uh, yeah, I don't know, let's see. trying to look at placement a little bit I kind of like I like having the you know the the microphone kind of over here and even though it's a little more modern than really we wanted this is it feels like this feels like 60s um, radio we're really looking for 30s but I couldn't really find anything that wasn't just a bunch of like I don't know just nothing that was really great that I thought uh, I'll continue to look but I think this little Kind of work for the moment. Um, 
so I would put that, and then I need to put another um, another name. So let me go get my name. Where'd it go? There's the name. I'm going to duplicate this. So copy and duplicate. And then put this one over here. And I'm going to change this to like... Rename this. That's one of the things you gotta do. You gotta rename. And then um, my title. So I'm copying this and duplicate, paste duplicate. And I'll move this over here. And we're gonna call this like a uh, line. Line manager, and we, you know, I might change these colors and think, you know, definitely change these colors and, and whatnot. All right, so this is looking at like a like a good base um, to start off with. So then I would, uh, you know, come in here and this is the let's see which scene are we on. I think this was, yeah, Proverbs only two. So this one, I'm gonna rename this scene here to host and guest. So that's kind of like the base, the base uh, scene. Uh, I'm gonna move this to the top, and then here's the the starting scene. I need to, you know, put the new, and this is like our old, this, like I said, I was using this as Ulysses World's base. All right, so host and guest, I'm going to duplicate this. I'm going to right click, choose duplicate. Um, I'm going to call it host and game guests. So this one is going to have more, uh, more guests on it. This is the fanfare video. I'm going to put that at the top. Because usually it kind of goes like after the starting soon scene, which I'll make. It'll go into the fanfare, and then we would go into the hosts. Um, and this is the hosts and guests. So I'm going to I would, would duplicate these guests um, and just add however many we're doing, three or four. And... That's pretty good, yeah. I think this is kind of where we want this to be right now. Although now that we, I don't know, this could get moved around a bunch of places. That stands out more there. We'll see. Uh, we'd have our logo uh, and then what game this is for, which you can probably guess. Given, given the 1930s radio and given the games we have, you can probably guess what this is for. But um, I think this will do for now. And then uh, I need to make this other one. Let's go ahead and start. We're on the game guest one. So I'm going to group, um, let's see, chat box two. Let's see, host image. Where did the other one go? Let's see, what image is this? <laughs> Fading suns. Yeah, right. Fading suns in 1930s. Uh, I think that oh, was this one. Yep. I'm going to rename this because I had a Tim's image, but it wasn't there. So this is actually Ross's image. <clears throat> I just, by the way, I just grabbed, oops, I just grabbed uh, Ross and, and uh, Bill randomly. So there's the line manager, Greg Gordon. That's that. And then Ross's image. Okay, so all of this should be a group. They should be able to group this all together. Group selected items. And I'm just going to call this Ross. Uh, I'm going to call this host uh, camera setup. 
So now I should be able to just like hide this and it hides everything. Perfect. All right, so there's that. And now I got this, this. So that's the edge, that's the image. And then I gotta get my name up there. I'm pulling them up here. And then I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna group all these together. And call it guest cam setup. And then same thing here. I should be able to hide it all. Perfect. All right. So now we've got both of those. Now I can. I should be able to duplicate. Let's see if I copy. This is something that um, OBS always messes me up with, but it looks like it worked great. Yay. Um, so I want to kind of shrink everything down. Uh, that actually reminds me. So I'm going to place this kind of where I think I want it. Hold on. I'm going to go put that in the background. One second. All right, so here's the background. This is the where we want it. And then now I'm going to go and um, lock the background. So that's this one. No, nope, that's the wrong one. Maybe that's what it wants. Yep, there you go. So now I cannot move the background, which is what I want. I'm going to take the first person and shrink it down since we're going to have multiple people. I might have to, I'm going to have to probably remove the titles on this one. Just because they're, they take up too much room. We need several, room for several people. So I'm just kind of resizing. So right now that's three people. Uh, let's go ahead and go ahead and remove the, remove the, title. Oops. See, and it does that sometimes. I've definitely had that happen as well. Sometimes it just like deletes things somewhat randomly. So let's go ahead and copy this again. Oh no, actually we want this copied. So copy and paste duplicate. But it pasted it at the full size, which is interesting. Pull that back down. All right. So that's two people. Oh, I want this one. I want to change that. I'm going to remove the title here. No, see, that's what it did. I just want to remove this title, not the whole setup. Looks like it, uh, that's maybe why it's doing it. So if I take this out, whoops, then I can delete it. Uh huh, I learned something. So, oh, apparently I did not learn something. <laughs> that's all right. This is the one that I want, anyways. Yeah, I'm definitely still learning. There's a lot, a lot in OBS, a lot of details. All right, I'm gonna copy that again. Paste it as a duplicate. And see what it looks like with four people. Uh, all right. So this one, we'll probably have like this were the main one, it'd be a person there. And I think we're gonna try to do four guests. Uh, so we can do that here, copy, paste, duplicate. Again, resize this. All right, so let's suggest we could have a logo here or something. Again, some of this will be some of this will be uh, kind of faded out just to make it not so busy. I mean, I feel like this looks pretty good. This feels a little bit busy right now. Um, I can make the name smaller. 
Um, I think it's mostly going to have to do with the background. Um, let's see. Let's get a, a logo here. I don't know if I have one in here. Oh, I get the slides of the logo. There's. Yeah, I'll just go grab the logo. I'm going to spoil it here. What show it's going to be. Uh, I don't know. I might have one in here. Let's see if I have it existing already. Mm, nope, doesn't look like it. The Torg logo. Just grabbing a logo from my file somewhere. I might need a larger one. It's not going to look right, but that's good for now. Or maybe this is where we do, like, if I have a background image to separate this a little bit, that might be better. Uh, we also, we're also going to need... Um, we're going to need a chat window uh, in here as well. So that would actually probably go here. Um, and then the... Um, a game map. Although that would have a different view. So this is going to be... Yeah, so there would be a chat window here for like Roll20 or whatever. Uh, and then we also need a game map. So a different view with people even smaller, maybe like all across the top, and then the rest of the view being the map. Uh, but I want to go right now to, um, what is the other stream? So I do a, the other Fading Zones, Heretical Musings. Heretical Musings, we're going to pop this up right now because I want the chat. So this is the chat window here. I, want, I can't remember what I did. There's the browser. So I just did a browser, and here's the pop-up for the chat, and I did a uh, 400 by 400. So I'm going to try to duplicate this. Oh, you guys can't see that right now, but that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go back over here. So it's a browser. So this is here. All right, so now I'm going to add a browser option. So I'm going to call this chat window. And that's the browser source. There we go. And we said 400 by 400 is what I used last time. And I can change some of these details as well. So I can make it a little bit bigger. And actually, I don't know if we want this here. No, we don't want this here. This is We want this in the other, the other window. Uh, so we got this here. You want a browser image. Uh, so this is Twitch chat, which is what we want. And this one's pretty big. We can resize this as well because we don't need the chat message. We also don't need the top thing here. I mean, we can make it. It's bigger or smaller as well. That text, I feel like, is pretty small. But that's more or less pretty good. Uh, we can also move these over. Oh, yeah, it's not grouped in this, in this view yet. So this is how this could look. And all these are just like, this is basically just a mock-up once, once we get a better idea of what we're actually doing. It will uh, we'll start to come together a little more. I'm still working on this too. Like I've seen, I don't know, a few versions of this. Uh, like screens, like what do, what do we want these to look like to make sure that people can see that there's you know, that there's chat happening, but also um, still be able to see the, the guests and the host. So that's just a, a basic mock-up there. 
Um, what else? Uh, so that's you know I don't I don't have a roll twenty image to put in there for for this. I would have like I said the chat would go here. Then I'm gonna need another make another one. Uh, welcome, fan of a truth. This is the uh, OBS. I use OBS. And so let's go ahead. So that was the home, uh, the host, and game guests. And then I'm gonna duplicate this again, and I'm gonna call this the um, host and roll twenty game. So we duplicated that again. So now I'm. Now we're going to, we probably would get rid of the logos here because we want maximum size. Maximum real estate for everything. So I'm gonna like bring this up here, something like this. Whoops, looks like I didn't lock the background, there we go. Something like this. Trykoff says the stream chat is nice for Q&A for putting streams on YouTube with a lot of interaction. Yeah, yeah. That, that is the goal for this, uh, for this game. It's definitely to have a lot of interaction. I don't know, we could do that and then have the GM over here with a little, a little bit larger. That looks pretty good. And then over here would be the roll 20 uh, image. Yeah, yeah, we wanted the roll, we wanted old, old radios for this. We really wanted 1930s. I think these are like 1960s here, but this just looks better, I think, than what we had. Um, our other options, which was that, which is basically what we did in, um, in the first part of the, uh, of the stream, kind of looking for what image we wanted to use. So let's see, uh, you know, so like I said, this is where roll 20 would be. Let me go ahead and pull up a roll 20 game that I'm in. And see if I can just sort of pull that up to see what it would look like. So I'm kind of signing in. Roll 20. Actually, I'll pull up. Uh, oh, here we go. Am I still in that? Yeah. Blood on the Blasted Lands game that I played a while back. All right, so that's coming up. So now I need to do a video or window capture. And this is called, I'm just gonna call it Roll 20 game. And bam, pulled it up perfectly. So this is also like, I would probably do two of these um, this, yeah, this would be a great actually spot. So I'm going to make this one small, smaller. So like here. And then, yeah, that fits pretty well. And then I'm going to make another one. So I'm going to duplicate this one. Uh, copy and duplicate. And this one is going to be the the chat. Um, this is going to be the roll 20 chat window. And so this one, this should be able to move over here. And I'm going to, again, if you hold alt, you can change the size of the window. So I really want just this chat window down here. Like this. And probably, probably don't need to see the type what people are typing. I just need to see the bottom. And then I'm gonna make it bigger. There you go. So now, if I just go test here, people can see that. 
and then um, and see that changes it if I look at that differently though but let's go like this oh, I'm just trying to mess around here um, I can't remember which was my character I think I was the samurai she's gonna try to make a roll uh, forget how to roll <laughs> Uh, is it the total he puts on? No, that doesn't look like it. I can't remember how to do it in this game. Whatever. You see what I'm trying to go for. Um, get back in the chat over here. And so you can see this is what I'm what I'm looking at right here. So we would still be able to see that. I mean, this could also go up here. I don't know. What do you think? I just want it to be visible wherever it is. And the names, I would probably make these a little bit smaller. Um, this window looks a little bit big. So the names I would make a little smaller and move them around a bit. Um, and then here is also, you know, it's the background does not look great here. I mean, this might be a good spot to use a more standard background. Um, like, you know, the, the black. I think that looks, I think that looks better. Well, I don't know. Uh, where do we go? So we get the host and guest. Yeah, not as busy. Yep. Uh, host and game guests. Where did that? Oh, it's down here. I'm just moving these around so they're more in the right order. Host and game guests, and then roll twenty. All right. So you get the game guests, the host and guests. Yeah. That's looking pretty good. Just for the base, you know, this, you know, we'll add more stuff. This is sort of like a proof of concept kind of thing. Um, we'll see. I'm not, I'm not super excited about this view, but it's again a start. So as you can see, we've got a new show upcoming. Um, it is a Torg show. Um, we'll see, uh, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll have some more announcements about this soon. Um, within probably a couple of weeks, we'll have an announcement. So get ready for a new Torg show. Uh, but I think that's going to be it for today. So for Ulysses Spiel, Ulysses International, I am Robert Adichie. Uh, thanks for, let's go over here. Uh, there you go. So thanks for coming and, uh, checking this out and helping me out through this and giving me, giving me some, uh, uh, some, some feedback, um, and we will let you know as soon as this gets announced. All right, so for Ulysses International, Ulysses Spiel, I'm Robert Ducci. Have a good day.